Bye. Everyone, get closer to the mic. Alright. You're not the boss of me. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> you are so close to it. Well, I'm just like... You're probably going to be the least heard. Yeah, that's true. This is six-eighths of uh, tip punch, or three-fourths if you want to um, divide reduce the it. <laughs> reduce the <laughs> fraction. How, is that it, reducing the fractions? Is that the phrase? You want to fry? I think so. Yeah. 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 No, I'm a theater like, major. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyway, today we have Nina, me, um, Lindsay, Kate, Java, Morgan, and Katrina. This sounds really half-assed. <laughs> McDonald's, so that's why we're not talking as much. We're, we're enjoying. We, if we do yes. talk, then we most likely have, like, food in our mouths, so it's all, like, mumbled noises. These are... I also bought discount candy, so go at it. Oh, Wait, like, discount of the discount? The two like, levels. How much was it? There's was half off, you doofus. But, like, from, but like, from, like, from what? Like, like, was it uh, half off... It was How seven. How much um, did you pay? It was three dollars when it was seven originally. That's so more than half. Yeah. Man. I it was like CVS. This isn't even candy. I am. Um, okay, but, I do have okay. Candy. Wait. <laughs> it's got some dollar signs. Yeah. 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 Y
I mean, yeah, yeah. That's, any. That's, yeah, but that's every. It's every. It's everything every, 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 in the two thousands ever. And Someone plus sing. Every. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you laughed. I'm the ass. <laughs> you had like that burp that. <laughs> yeah. Um, Can I have the singular fry? Oh, also, yeah. There also has oh, there's to be. Oh. Even if the dad's I didn't even secret, notice. You want it? Yeah, yeah there also has to be a big secret. Oh, uh, maybe okay. like a, a double identity. Not even Hannah Montana, but if they do sports. Wait, what was the one you said in the elevator? Something pepperoni. Um, oh no, that was from an SNL sketch where it's like, um, and now for the next thing is Cody pepperoni. <laughs> <laughs> I thought That's you made that up. Montana. No, yeah. I guess I made that Even up. Even if Bucky dad, Kentucky, baby. Even if the dad isn't necessarily mm. thick, he has to be like. <laughs> he has isn't necessarily. <laughs> well, he's got to be like oddly hot. You're really thinking. No, you know? no, no, they're always creepy, so. super white, like yeah, but like at foot least, fetish. Mm. <laughs> Like Elizabeth McGuire dad. Wait, who was the dad on that TV show with the little girl? Billy Ray Cyrus. No. <laughs> I thought you were Cyrus for Halloween. It was oh, like Scotty or whatever. She, no, she was like a little Charlie. girl. No, she was like a little baby, and it was like all surrounded around. Oh, Charlie. Good luck, Charlie. Yeah. Yeah. Bob Bobby experience. Dog with a blog, though. The worst fucking show I've ever seen. The best fucking show. That dog has his own damn MacBook. Okay, I find it really funny that on the podcast I work for, we talked about Dog with the Blog, and now on my own podcast, it's full circle. It's come, it's come around, guys. Honestly, the only yeah. like my sister watches a lot of Disney Channel because she's twelve. The only good show I think is left is um, Girl Meets World. Okay, Girl Andy Girl. Mac. Don't, don't sleep on Andy Mac. Andy Mac is good. No, um, Bizarre right. Vark is okay. Yeah. Bizarre yeah. Vark. Yeah. I've only Jake Paul ass out of here. Okay, so yeah. I don't. Yeah, I don't like Jake Paul, but I only saw these shows because I was babysitting, and I was like, "Whoa, these are actually decent." Like Andy Mack is definitely okay because the person who wrote Lizzie McGuire wrote Andy Mack. Yeah. Can we talk about the good Disney Channel shows? Um, yeah, that's Raven. Raven. Yeah. It's probably the best one. I think. Oh, wow. Oh, that's Nick at Night. Wasn't Lopez type shit? Wasn't Wizards oh, of Waverly Place like the only Disney Channel show to win an Emmy? I wasn't. No idea. Yeah, I think well, Boy Meets uh, World won an Emmy, and that's Boy Meets Disney. World might have won an Emmy, yeah, which was a good fucking show. Wait, did they seriously cancel Girl Meets World? Yeah, they did. Yeah. Why? I think they had like a contract that a uh, show on Disney can only be three seasons long. Mm-hmm. Only sixty-two episodes. Because mm-hmm. the kids are just growing up. You know? uh, that's why Hannah yeah. Montana has two. Um, like shows. really, uh, yeah, like Hannah Montana. Same as Zach and that. Cody, yeah. Um, I met one of the guys from Boy Meets World because he was at a local baseball game in my town. That's a classic and Kate yeah, conundrum. Yeah, it was um, not the love interest, but the, the kind of nerdy one. I don't remember. Her friend? Farkle. Farkle was his name. Farkle was, it rolls off the tongue. It you know? does. Farkle. Anyway, he was very nice. What about Disney Channel original movies? What about the OG ones that we like? Oh. High School Musical, of course. That's like All the High School Musicals are beautiful. I just watched the Hannah Montana movie. Oh, it's And so Jan good. from The Office is in it. Wait, what? Oh, yeah. Yeah, she yeah was, she's um, Billy Ray Cyrus's love interest. Mm-hmm. And he's like, oh, oh I don't know. Oh, you're right. right. I thought you said Jin from The Office and then she said Billy Ray Cyrus. <laughs> <laughs> And that would have so made, made a better oh, movie. Wait, but guys, was great. we have not even started our pilot. <laughs> we're just talking oh, about what we like. Yeah, we're getting ideas. Yeah, we're that's true. We're reminiscing. This is a long-ass Camp Rock. Camp Rock was good. Camp Rock was good. Yeah. Yeah. Camp, Camp Rock 2. Camp Rock 2 was so bad. The song about, uh, the song where De- um, Demi's character was trying to, like, get them back into it, that was the most cringeworthy thing I've ever seen. Remember when she had a tooth I gap in the first one? Oh, cute. Mm-hmm. Camp Rock tried really hard to be High School Musical. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Jonas yeah. Brothers were the only things that. Do you guys it. remember um, Read It and Weep? Because that yes! was so good. Yeah, good show. I remember I wanted her laptop so bad. I asked my dad too. I was like, what, what are the laptops you draw shows. on? Do you guys remember Stuck in the Suburbs with Terry oh. Killam? Oh. Yeah. Oh, 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 Stuck in the Suburbs was great. I feel bad because Kate did not grow up with cable. So. I did not, so I don't know these. Yeah. Like familiar to me. Minutemen. I got PBS. Yeah. Like, yeah. Arthur like, was, really was my favorite. Yeah. Yeah. That was the girl. Arthur was it. And, um, <laughs> my mom's dating a vampire. <laughs> that was so so good. Smart, good. Smart, yeah. smart House. Okay. I hated oh, Smart House. I had a little fashion to make. 
So the movie Read It and Weep. You know how she got like super famous because like her diary was leaked. So I are wrote, you doing that? <laughs> <laughs> is this is what happened to you. I, um, I bought a slam book from Limited Two and I wrote all this shit about the kids in my class and just let everything out there. And then I left it on one of the kids' desks and walked away. <laughs> so they could all find it. And then they all read it and like. They didn't know whose it was. And it did not go like I just sat in the corner and watched the whole school explode. <laughs> that's like, yeah, like the whole school was just my class. Yeah. Did anyone find out it was you? What? Did anyone find out it was you? Yeah, this kid Tony ratted me on. Tony. Tony. Tony, what you got? <laughs> oh, man, I'll prank so many people. She got him. She's a scammer. <laughs> yeah. What was the one with the basketball? I oh, you see how seven? Like, oh, no, no, no. Jump you know, in. I, I, I know that Irish? that's not what you were like, talking about. Yeah, love of the Irish. Like, Irish. Love of the Irish. No, he, it was the jump in, I think, because his dad said he should jump rope. Like, not basketball. <laughs> <laughs> well, jump in was involved. Let's all yell at Jaffe for not knowing the difference. Remember, oh my God, remember Corbin Blue Kale would push it to the oh. limit? Oh, uh, push it. That was. But then Katrina with a cover single. Where's Corbin now? He's like oh, old man. He's a daddy. I think really? he cut his hair. Mm -hmm. Wait, I can get it up. Sorry. <laughs> I accidentally Sorry. stopped the recording. Oh, <laughs> oh, when I was talking about beating from Even Steven. That's fine. Okay, <laughs> yeah. Even Steven's movie. Do you remember mm -hmm. Phil of the Future? Yeah. <laughs> well, okay. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. The ending of Phil of the Future was... They kiss. Him and Keely got together, and then they finally, the dad finally fucking fixed the time machine. But first of all, the dad all, was so great. No, can we all agree that yeah. the dad was maybe one of the worst characters Disney Channel? Oh, the dad, yeah. He's yeah. toxic. Oh. He's, he's toxic. so problematic. Who is he? <laughs> yeah. oh he looks like a dad. He he's, looks like his dad, who he, was in everything he did. Corbin Blue is actually doing Broadway now. Mm -hmm. I, he's well, very good. Really? Yeah, he's a, he's a really good dancer. Most Disney now. people are trained in musical theater. Because you have to be singers and dancers yeah, and like. Do it all. I don't understand cool. why you need to be a singer to be on Disney Channel. Because it makes them money. But I think it's annoying. Well, well yeah, it is. Really it's it's uh, the the <laughs> I will say, Bridget <laughs> Mellor no, had surprisingly good music. Mm. Lemonade she had Mouth. Some vibes. I Lemonade never. I was mouth. never into Lemonade Mouth. That was like. Oh, I thought, I thought it was cheesy as fuck. But her song. Was that a show was or a movie? I, I do not know. Um, um, what was the, uh, Ready or Not, Here I Can. Yeah, that's the false. Ready or Not, Here I Can. Jaffa, go. Shut up, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this was a song. This was like a, Ready or Not, Here I Can. Wait, maybe just because I want to agree with you? Maybe because I'm deaf, I didn't know it. <laughs> Um, wait, uh, I think someone in this room can uh, re-sing the entire Victoria soundtrack. I don't know who it is, but they should, <laughs> they should, they should un reveal un themselves. No, in a way that proves to the whole yeah. school that they can sing. Once again, you're lost, uh, but now I'm in. I'll breathe it in and let it go. I don't know the rest and of the words. And you don't like, know where you are now, or what it would come to if only somebody could hear. When Victoria's had some good vibes. Y'all yeah, see that yeah, pedophile yeah. ass? The one, like, like whenever they were like, she was an owl who was a pedophile. Her and fucking weird. Ariana. Ariana. Or no, no Jane. 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 And they were like, Jane was a bitch. And those, like, guys were like, hitting them. Oh, all I know what you mean. What is that song? Oh, yeah, they were like, oh, you showed me the music video from one of them where it's like the boyfriend was cheating on her. Fuck, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, I can't think of it. Should we look it up? Well, it was a bop. And personally, I thought that Take a hint. Yes. Oh, that was the one you showed me. I think you could use a hint. Take a hint. That was a good line. Did Dan Schneider write all the songs? Dan the man, foot <laughs> <put laughs> fetish and. I personally thought that Jade was the best singer, actually, on that mm. show. Maybe an unpopular mm. opinion, but I thought she had the best songs. Well, I think when Tim Punch really comes out with their I first album, all had really good songs. <laughs> <laughs> I think we all can sing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, so but did Victoria like justice respond to that? Yeah, I think we all can sing. Yeah, she totally was like the whole thing was taken out of context. Oh really? But okay, I, Victoria. But I also it was so clear that she was well, she was being a bitch. I think too, like, wasn't the reason why it ended was because Ariana Grande kind of wanted to go off and do her own thing. 
Yeah. Because the but show then they already accept Sam and Kat, and then, like, apparently, mm-hmm. like, her and Jeanette McCurdy did not yeah, get along. No. Well, they, do you really like, think they would get along? Oh, no. They were just trying to, like, melt Jeanette McCurdy, I was just so mean to this. She seems weird as fuck. She is. Jeanette? So. Yeah. Yeah. I respect her for her character as Sam on the great show. That had to be the most fun role to play. Okay, ah, Seti yeah. for life. Um, You're so right. <laughs> <laughs> Who the okay, yes. Who the Ships fuck Freddy? For one episode. Mm. And that's that's it. So I hated well. Freddy. Freddy was a bitch. She was yeah. so annoying. But their relationship was like though. fucked up. Yeah. Mm-hmm. When you like look at it from an, it was an abusive relationship. What I mean, too is that it what like ha- it's funny because Sam is like such a bitch, but anytime her and Freddy were together, it's funny. it was always Freddy's fault. Why it was toxic, I think. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It was never yeah. Sam's fault. Oh, Freddy was candy. Asshole. Go at so it. Oh, I'm okay. Well, we're kind of <laughs> into, like, Nickelodeon now. Uh, uh, I would say 2000's children's shows. We'll just title that. Yeah. Thank you for deciding the in, uh, the title for me. Dream and Josh. Dream and Josh. Yeah. 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 Wait, um, recently single, uh, recently tweeted a photo of the Drake and Josh. Like, the, remember the episode where they had, like, the the body doubles or like oh, the, the, yeah, what yeah. were that Droy and Drew and Jer- Jerry Droy <laughs> Jet and Droy I love Droy um okay so if we were to have a sitcom or a movie pitched to Disney Channel who would the main character so be so I'm just gonna throw it out two kids in a trench coat oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. and one of them like turns into a hamster by like Midnight. Wait, mm-hmm. we gotta write this down. Spirit. Someone. <laughs> uh, lightning strike. Yeah, at, every time a lightning strikes, and he's like afraid of lightning. Yeah. Oh, turns okay. into a backstory. Like, like it. Yeah. Wait. And wait. So, some sort of fucked up secret. Recap. Recap. Okay, so two boys, one trench coat. Two girls, one cup. And he has to hide yeah. the fact that he's a hamster from everything. Yeah. yeah. So the bottom one, I think that'll be comical, is the one on the bottom Turns is the hamster. hamster. <laughs> so every time, he's just like this little hamster's carry around. Yeah. Boy. He's got little whiskers on his chin and no one knows why. <laughs> <laughs> um, pure Disney. Yeah. 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 So, uh, here's my question. Two, two boys, one trench coat. When they're, <laughs> That's the title. <laughs> when they're in the trench coat, are they posing as one, like, alternate identity or is everyone's like oh they're the two kids that like climb on each other every day like, no i think i think it'd be a secret they think it's one person okay yeah. and well, they think it's whoever's on top and i think the person on top should be named droy <laughs> <laughs> so droy and the hamster ham tar no mm. that's an idea <laughs> yeah that <laughs> Like, I'm not, lost. So like, like not Hamtaro or Naruto. Oh. The theme song's like, okay. he's a human, he's a hamster, <laughs> put him in the and what do you get? Two <laughs> boys, two, <laughs> two boys, two boys, one coat, one coat. <laughs> My <laughs> trench coat, father, son, and Holy Spirit. <laughs> God comes in and takes them away. <laughs> they die. <laughs> Spoiler. And for casting, the two boys are Billy Ray and Corbin Bloom. They are young boys. <laughs> they are oh my God. young boys. We in a trench coat. Young boys. <laughs> Two, two and brothers. one, two brothers, one coat, one's a hamster, one's a human, whoa. And then we get a rap segment from the... I, from, Lucas Gabriel. No, oh, I'm no. thinking Iggy Azalea, but I don't know if I'll have the budget. See, that's why I'm saying Lucas Gabriel. She can't yeah, be that. 2017 and everybody has the budget for Iggy Azalea. And then we also, <laughs> wait, can the hamster boy be the teen heartthrob that like, yeah, goes like, all that's over like, yeah. Bop <laughs> magazine? Yeah. Tiger Beat? like, I have a acne. <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna have like sponsorship from um proactive and all the acne commercials yeah. did you know disney channel started doing like real like commercials like you know growing up it was always their own commercials <clears throat> but when i was babysitting um and watching the disney channel with uh yeah. <laughs> like all of a sudden they showed a real commercial and at the very end it would go uh company name is a proud sponsor of the Disney Channel. And it was like very weird. It was like brought to you by a dog with a blog. 
Jesus, the name that our luck, plucky young heroes call to the heavens as they <laughs> fall off a cliff. Yeah. No, yells Droy. Droy, Droy. Yeah. Wait, did we decide the name of the other character? Oh, yeah, we could change that. That was just a whip, work in progress. Well, I think as one, as one trench-coated person, they are called Droy. Yeah. Oh, yeah, one's that's Drake, a good... One's Troy. One's Droy, Drake, Droy. one's Josh. <laughs> <laughs> but for copyright reasons, they are Droy. Droy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, one can be Dan and the other can be Schneider. Schneider's going to be a cute name. I would name my son slash daughter. It's a very business Daughter? Name. Yeah. That is... It's an androgynous name, you know? Mm-hmm. Oh, We're all about uh, gender fluidity here at uh, Two watched. Boys, One Coat. Yes. Um, <laughs> can Bella be a villain? Yeah. Oh, yes. yeah. She Bella could be the villain. She could be the villain. Or the love interest. Oh, uh, both. both. Wait, both. Oh. Villain, love interest. She could be she a could girl. She could come between them. Yeah, she could come between them. She could be a girl in a small coat. <gasps> one know, wait, 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 coat. Thorn. Is that too much? Maybe one, one wait, girl, two, one two coat. Coats, one girl. <laughs> yeah. Wait, that'd be really good. So yeah. the love interest slash villain is a girl who wears two coats. Just have her yeah. wear her old stuff from Shake It Up. Yeah. Oh yeah, and, and one worse. of those inner vests that like oh, they God, always wore in two thousand eight. Trend. Well, that was a thing. Yeah. <laughs> Do you have pictures? I wish I did. I had two I of them. Vests and leggings, oh, and, like boy. jean skirts over leggings, and those hats. Oh, yeah. Puffy <laughs> hats. Like, I was the epitome of, like, Ashley Tisdale, red carpet 2005 type of Oh, with the, the oh. armpit bag, the bag that if you put it up to your so shoulder, so when you're armpit. You, yeah. were, were, <laughs> you were worshipped in a previous time. Yeah. All right. I mean, that's yeah, my brand. In the end of the she movie. She was one girl, can, two coats. In the end of the movie, can Zendaya, can Zendaya kill Bella Thorne? Oh. Yes. Oh. And she obtains three coats. Oh. <laughs> and she has two hamsters in each coat. <laughs> The story. Wait, wait, so she kills everybody? <laughs> How does Zendaya play into this? <laughs> she's gone. She just appears yeah. on the yeah, How is Zendaya not in the new Lion King? We were just looking at the oh, cast so for that. True. How did she not make the cut? Maybe <laughs> her singing isn't as strong? That's a good point. I hate how people are calling it the live action when it's clearly just CGI. It's a remake. A remake! Yeah. <laughs> cool. So I recently watched um, the recently single. Recently single. No, um, <laughs> the That's So Raven reboot, like Raven's oh, now. Oh, yeah. Oh, so yeah. Just, that was my favorite show. It's really cringy. It's, mm. like, it's, it's like, like oh, remember the old That's the thing with screen. reboots. It's yeah. either really good like, or really bad. I the, first, the first episode of Raven's Home was okay. Yeah. And yeah. yeah. It's, it's Chelsea's son and then the, the white friend who acts black that ruins the whole thing for me. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I saw, like, a little bit of one episode, and it made me, like, sad, because I was like, oh, it's just, like, Raven, but instead it's her offspring. And it was, like, you know, nostalgic, because you see all, like, the, the old stuff. But then, like, when you actually watch it, the new characters are just so bad. Yeah, it was actors aren't what they used to be, you know? I just like Devon being in it. Like, yeah, like, that was Devon cute. Was, like, my first, like, TV, like, show crush. I was in love with Devon. Wait, time. can we talk about Fuller House? Because I... Okay. Genuinely oh, enjoyed garbage. season oh. one, but season two is garbage. Yeah, there's a, uh, there's there's a season, season three, three or a mile garbage, so I don't want to. There's a season three. There's a season three, but I, I never. I stopped yeah. at season two. I, I only stopped. knew because Blake from recently, single, last year mm-hmm. told me not to watch season two because it's shit. It's I asked so him crazy. about it. Well, I think season one was so enjoyable because it was just all callbacks from the original. Yeah. Season. So it's fun for a season. But the whole, like, bit where they're like, and Michelle's yeah, not yeah. here, <laughs> and it's like, okay. Like, I kind of understand, and I feel bad, because, um, what was it, both of them at the time of shooting were planning their weddings, and the only one, like, Ashley quit acting, and the only one who would be willing to do it was Mary-Kate, but she was planning her wedding, yeah. and they were, like, genuinely sorry about it, that's why they were kind of like, and myth? they both, like, were, they never really had a choice whether they wanted to act or not. Yeah, yeah no. They were like, two months like, old. They're also married to very old okay. men. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like, it's really, How it's old are they? The, the girls, like I think, 30s. are, like, early 30s, and the guys are, like, late 50s. Oh, oh yeah. I feel bad for them, though, because they did start so young, and they didn't really have yeah. a choice. Yeah, and they did so much. Mm-hmm. Does anyone know the boy next door from Fuller House? It's a buck. <laughs> <laughs> Silence. I think so. Was it? Maybe. Wait, is it the... Oh, the, the, sister, the 
the neighbor, yes. Kimmy's daughter, sings it? N- no. Can't oh my god, the kids Jody on Fuller is. House are so fucking annoying. They They're are, annoying, yeah. but I kind of started to like the dynamic between DJ's kid and the other girl. How they, I wanted them to be together. I don't know, I'm just so <laughs> Y'all romantic. are Cory in the house. Mm. <laughs> my favorite anime. <laughs> <laughs> I actually like, I mean, that version of a reboot wasn't really that bad. Oh, I hated that show. Oh, I, hated I don't that. know, I hated, I hated Newton Mina. When I was at home over the summer, I was looking through, like, old stuff of mine, and I found this, like, when I was, like, eight, I apparently made my own newspaper, it was called, the like, the Nina Times or something, oh, and the, know. yeah, I know, and the main article, like, the, the main, uh, the big story, the big scoop of that paper was ratings for Corey in the house stink, <laughs> and it was, like, it was just me bashing on Corey in the house, I was like, this show Stupid! It doesn't have an overarching plot. Yeah. It's like it was like what the fuck? Kyle Massey's trying to rap now. And he oh, like yeah. posts photos Mitchell with. Is. Okay, I saw that Mitchell Russo is like hanging out with Will Smith's kid. Well, I don't know. Jaden. Oh, yeah, like, like, Did you see Neo Yokio, 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 Yokio Jaden Smith's show? No. Is that just me? He oh, made yeah. an anime on Netflix called Neo Yokio, and it's yeah, like a I, big deal. I haven't seen it, but I know what you're. It's like, yeah. okay, so it's like Will Smith's kid was like, I'm gonna make an anime, and he did, and I hear mixed reviews on it. Like, some people are like, it's really funny, and some people are like, it's just shit. I kind of just want to watch it for the visual appeal when I'm high, so... The like, only, <laughs> like, really funny thing about it is there's, like, this part, because, like, you could tell, like, when they were recording the voice acting, like, none of them cared, and, like, there's this part where he's like, I'm gonna visit her, and I'm gonna give her a big Toblerone, and he gets a big <laughs> Toblerone, uh, and, yeah, no, and he gives her, and he's like, I come, and I brought the Toblerone, and then when he gets there, and they get into, like, a fight, and he goes, you don't deserve the Toblerone, <laughs> and, like, Toblerone. <laughs> <laughs> the whole episode is about this damn giant-ass Toblerone. Uh, granted, that's the best candy out there. Listeners, if you want to watch a funny ass video, <laughs> type <look> Lindsay. Up- <laughs> <laughs> look up Arch- Archive. Archive. <laughs> Supreme Edge Lord. <laughs> yes. I the kid with the fedora. It's so funny. I watch it like once a day. <laughs> he speaks like a freaking like anime villain. <laughs> okay, you know, we'll, it speaks like me. We'll do Just say it. You know. <laughs> Wait, can I, can you turn it around? I didn't see. I didn't get a good look. Okay, he does oh, look like you. Me now? Man. I just thought, you know, shout out my boy. You know, not being able to see while he was talking was really an out of body experience. <laughs> it's Very, like you were a judge on the Voice. Oh, oh my yeah. god. Can we like? Okay, so. Let's bring back to you. Well. Fun fact. We're going to be doing a video collab with improv group Recently Single yeah. this week where we give them makeover. Thank God you all picked up on that cue. <laughs> uh, so why don't we hash out some of our ideas? We made a whole like PowerPoint Google Doc thing and it just ended up with someone mm-hmm. posting a photo of Shrek on every single page until it got to be like 50 pages. So, um, there are five people in Recently Single. Two of them are not single. So, calling out this lie, first off. Uh, second off, um, let's talk about the styles we were thinking of uh, making over onto these people. Drag queen. Dra- no, okay. Um, <laughs> so, first member, Chris Larson. Chris Fartson. Oh, oh got him! Yeah! Fuck you, Chris! Oh, fuck you, Chris! Okay. I don't even think he, he's gonna listen. Yeah, to this. Well, I mean, if we tell them they're mentioned in this, they might be like, yeah, oh, they will. Okay, so we'll tell them. So now that you know, recently single. 
Um, so Chris Arson, I was thinking like Zara, kind of sorority girl bitch, uh, preppy. I was also thinking, um, like Lindsay mentioned this before you all got here, like we do a little segment where we each like bring in $10 or something, pool it together and give them money and it's like you have to go to a thrift store yeah, and buy something. Store, we're like, let's go, like, like, and we'll edit it to be like a makeover for fucking HGTV type shit. Yeah. And um, they get to pick out their own. We'll give them, like, a template. Like, this is what you have to look like by the end of this, but we'll give you the creative freedom within that template. Mm. We can also go crazy. We can also veto things that, yeah, are, can. that yeah. are ugly. Well, that's like, um, yeah. They get to keep it. Yeah, <laughs> Skirts and shirts and tits. Oh, my. Uh, so, Larson. Bitchy. Yeah, bitch. What? Sorority girl. La- has a business degree. Oh. Yeah. Uh, has two Yorkies, yeah. maybe an alcohol problem, who knows, <laughs> has a father that never truly loved her. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, okay. <laughs> then next would be Blake. Blake's kind Blake of Shilm. like... Blake Shell. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so Blake kind of is like into like emo culture, although albeit not an emo boy, but he's like <laughs> into emo stuff. So I was I thinking... targeted by this. <laughs> I know. Um, so, anyway, before I was rudely interrupted, <laughs> we, <laughs> bit, <laughs> anyway, go on, <laughs> don't, don't ever stop locking your eyes with me, um, so, then after Blake, oh no, we didn't even do Blake, <laughs> oh, yeah. so for Blake, no. um, it's not important, forget about yeah, it, yeah, forget next. Blake, uh, work next. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna make Blake kind of like a Tumblr, Emo, like not totally like hot topic emo okay. girl, Sugar, but like cigarette. Yeah, ch- very yeah. Tumblr, very like, like my c- cigarette ashes blush. Maybe. Yeah, definitely. Like my dad never really respected me, so now I'm in Is art this a school. Is with all of them? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they all have a daddy issue to some degree. That should have been the name of their group. Mm. Daddy issues. <laughs> <laughs> Next is AJ. Oh, um, oh, AJ. Like, uh, urban, uh, yeah, Instagram Urban Outfitters girl. Because yeah. his outfits now are pretty much like Urban Outfitters. So we were thinking, like, translate that to a woman. Like, take, like, a little too clean cut and then, like, shake it. Mm. You know what I mean? Shake! <laughs> we, we take AJ <laughs> and we <laughs> shake him! <laughs> we're gonna shake him! <laughs> we're gonna fuck him up with! <laughs> um, next is Joe. Uh, so Lana Del Rey aesthetic. Flower no, we already have though. talked about this. Joe is going to be white wine mom. Oh, <laughs> and okay, I, a little Lana Del Rey. Yeah, a little. That's more, oh uh, yeah. Not really. A little. <laughs> we really want to get like a velour tracksuit. Um, <laughs> yeah. But we found a shirt online. This is where the inspiration came from when we were browsing Google Images. We found this shirt that says, friends, wine, family, what else would you need on a Saturday? <laughs> Like, oh, this should be what Joe's uh, overarching character should like be. Like a white pantsuit and Jesus sandals. Yeah, and like really like weird, like very high pants. Can we get her the then Bethany? Um, I was oh, looking very um, Bellissima. Like, uh, Fedora like, neckbeard. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we have to make Bethany ugly. She's too pretty. Yeah, she's too, the, we have too to, pretty for this. As, as women, we have to fight for dominance, <laughs> as clearly. <laughs> this is how we were built. Um, I think edgelord, like fedora. Um, <laughs> is that not what I just said? Like polo. Um, yeah. Oh, man. Like, we have to, those, like... Uh, tag out shirts. <laughs> yeah. Cyrus sneakers. Wait, can we find her a shirt that says, uh, if an emergency, break glass, and it's like a condom or something in her shirt? Does that exist? What? Yeah, what? no, it's like, it's like, okay, Katrina knows what I'm talking about because it was on a YouTube video. This guy literally wears a shirt that's like, it has like, a, you know those like fire, like in case of fire or emergency break glass. It, instead, it's like, it's the same thing, but in like this little plastic like see-through uh, thing, it has a condom in it. It's <laughs> fucking stupid. It's so stupid. <laughs> and I can picture Bethany rocking it. <laughs> We can buy that, but then we have to burn it. Well, it's <laughs> Bethany's forever, it. so. Give it to me. 
That's true. That's a really Morgan. <laughs> so for Bethany, I was kind of leaving it up to Morgan because you have more of a... Uh, <laughs> a dry- <laughs> what are you trying to say? You very careful. Um, and a more dry, like a more androgynous look. We wanted. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Right. I'm not gonna like be like Morgan. Shit. You're a lesbian. You're a lesbian. <laughs> we get it. You wear bandanas. <laughs> um. So I was kind of like we all kind of worked with the guys, but I'm giving Morgan's free kind of free range on Bethany because you got like. That a judge and get free range. It's like we own them. <laughs> Here, take her. Um, who's everyone's? Uh, who's everyone most excited about dressing up? Can we go over the themes again? Okay, okay so yeah. Cro- Larson, bitch. <laughs> uh, Joe, mom. <laughs> um, Blake, Blake, sad. Sad. <laughs> AJ, capitalism. <laughs> <laughs> Bethany, androgynous edge lord. Yeah, <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> uh, so yeah, those are the themes. The overarching. <laughs> we wait. Uh, let's like remake our Disney Channel pilot and make it a androgynous <laughs> edge. <laughs> it's starring Bethany, <laughs> and then her mom could be Joe. Wait, guys, get a pen and paper. This is ingenious. <laughs> Her mom could be Joe, her sister could be Bitchy Larson, and her best friend could be Emo Blake. Oh, and AJ could be there, too. <laughs> Whew, okay. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys like our proposal. Um, at Disney? Oh. Yeah, at Disney, at Recently Single, at Steve Harvey. If you have any comments, <laughs> concerns, feel free to email me at my email. But um, except for Recently Single, they do not have a choice in this matter. Yeah, right. you actually... You really don't have a choice but it's nice to act like you do just as a common courtesy yeah it's like nice to it's kind of like you know how dan schneider treats his shows like (laughs) we do give him the option we talked a long time about how dan schneider's a pedophile before everyone came here yeah that is is probably the best my voice quivered on twitter i've ever seen yeah, it's the most. Uh, it's the most um, smart. Uh, the most evidence. Oh. Speaking of, oh, uh, that that I do not believe that Avril Lavigne is dead. Okay, that one that freaks me out. Yeah, it does. It's because it's like someone like really thought deep about that, and I, I doubt that that's true. I don't want to. One of the person. reasoning, like in the the theory of Avril Lavigne being dead, one of the reasons that someone said was she left the Sum Forty One singer for the head of Nickelback. I was like, that's not a reasoning. Love, love my dude. Yeah, no, that's like that not guy reasoning. Has a great voice. <laughs> oh, uh, I'm, I'm out of the group now. Yeah, yeah. Um, you I think that's really big of you for admitting yeah, that. You. <laughs> but you're, you're also you're, you're also <laughs> kicked out of the tip party. Look at this crap. <laughs> Look at this crap. <laughs> Guys, when's our singing career gonna begin? Never. When's my life gonna begin? <laughs> We should make a Disney princess movie. Yeah. Okay. Two yeah. two dresses, one princess. <laughs> and she's a hamster. There's <laughs> a like, section of YouTube where people, I, like H3H they talk about where they just like dress up like Elsa yeah, and like so in like, like, characters and they do like real sexual it's like stuff. Fetishy? Yeah, it's like, like, it's like kids characters. Oh, I mean it's like there's like out. fart fetishes and we explored that on the last tit cast so uh, pause this video. Yeah. Look at new time. Go check that out. Go check that out. Uh, ASMR farts anyone? <laughs> um, I know my kink is out there in the world. There's this one <laughs> channel where this girl um I saw him on like a Shane Dawson video to my friend sent it to me and this girl like dresses okay, it's so fucked up. She dresses up like a baby and has her own crib and shit. Oh, people do that, and yeah. Her boyfriend is her daddy and he changes yeah. her diaper and it's like the sexualization of a Wait, baby. was this the My oh, yeah. Strange Addiction thing or a whole new No, it's like oh, this girl. So like, more than like, one person does this? Yes. Multiple people. Well, oh, when you think God. about the anime is kind of a fetishization of it's like a, young yes, children because a lot it's of it's disgusting. It, okay. Just at me, guys. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just saying, like, the only reason why I judge anime so harshly is because I've seen way too many, like, anime porn screens in high school. Like, it's... Oh. Scar- <laughs> 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 Scream! Like, 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 
like an intervention. I've seen. Like, I've seen. Or like me. she's in therapy. Like oh, I've, I've seen too many <laughs> anime porn. Every time screen. I was in the back, every time I was in the back of study hall, there was either someone watching a Blood on the Dance Floor music yeah, video or anime blood. porn. No, don't say yeah. those words. PTSD. <laughs> blood on the Dance Floor. <laughs> Uh, Their one song goes hard though. <laughs> it's oh, what's bewitched. Not. You got me bewitched. Cause I'm under your spell. Oh, oh. yeah, that's a great. Why are you idea. holding your chapstick like a cigarette? I'm just saying. <laughs> I know. Just something to Can I uh, puff, puff, pass, please? <laughs> <laughs> For those at home, she's holding her chapstick like a cigarette. Oh, Applying it in the way of Do you have herpes? No, I don't have herpes. Oh, you answered that seriously. I was joking, but. <laughs> <laughs> I just I don't know that I don't have herpes. Oh, I just bought this. Let the, the record show mm -hmm. that Morgan does not have herpes. No. I she thought, does I not. I, did. I thought she I did. does not. I thought I did. She does not. Oh, you thought. Whoa, wait. You thought you did. I really thought I did. I really thought I did. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, my um, stomach hurts. I don't. Mm. It's just like you know when you get like one of the like when you get you're like one of those like things. Well, like, when you get a, a zit on your mouth, that is a uh, form of herpes. Well, cold what it's not. Yeah. yeah. Well, I thought it was a I thought it was a cold sore, but then it like didn't burn or anything. It was just like a pimple, and then I like popped it, and now I'm back to normal. Ah, guys, I do not have herpes. She does not. She I does not. not she did not. <laughs> she did not. <laughs> I did not. I <laughs> Oh, oh my God. God. The guy on the elevator when we went to get you, he looked exactly like Mark mm -hmm. from the room, and we both got Mark. Thank you. Oh, yes. Thank you. That was a fan. That was an that encounter was with a fan. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we all. Yeah. We're super cool. We, we leave our door unlocked. Door unlocked. <laughs> Let's not let the public know this. <laughs> they don't know where our, we live. They don't know where we. They don't know where we reside. Well, yeah, because you guys don't live here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't live here. Um, well, she does shower here. Mm. <laughs> Dirty. Once. <laughs> so, I don't know uh, what I want to do. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, okay, <laughs> hot topic. What do you think about <laughs> Doc's candy? This is important. I know I can't get a response immediately. I probably never will, but who the fuck has <laughs> Dots? And Nobody. That's what I'm I saying. got discounted candy Dude. and this Dots Tootsie Roll. It's kind of like I got it because I love. It's like all shitty candy, and I love Tootsie Roll pops. That's why I was maybe addicted. Yeah, I had yeah. not had Tootsie Roll pops since like maybe third grade. Tootsie Roll pops are the best, but like everything else in that damn bag is garbage. Except for the actual Tootsie Rolls. Yeah, I mean, yeah, those are okay. They don't have that candied outside, and you can't bite it in three times like the owl told me you could with that crunch. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. I would, like, seriously, like, commit homicide for reasons right now. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Just to be clear, Morgan is not committing homicide. <laughs> she doesn't have... Money. Uh, <laughs> okay, listen, I'm right next to a prison. I can just check myself in. <laughs> she doesn't have herpes. She will commit homicide. H H H H H. H, H. Oh my God, wait. Acapella girl. Oh, no. yeah. <laughs> if I was a homeless man and like literally on the streets of Chicago in the wintertime, that must be the shittiest like scenario mm. ever. Mm. I would just commit a crime and go to oh, jail. So many, I think a lot of people do that actually. With oh, okay. They're just, just like on. yeah, because it's like free shelter and food. Yeah. Yeah. No, we live by a. I don't. don't I don't tell them where we live. Yeah, I don't want to say too much, but we live very close to a prison, and. Uh, Why is Morgan so bewildered? No, I'm just saying that like. <laughs> if well, now I'm gonna I can't, that. <laughs> if I can't pay rent, I'll commit a small crime, go to jail for like six months, and I'll be fine. Be <laughs> isn't like orange is a new black. It's like. I was just much happier, say, much worse. Whoa. Well, <laughs> yeah, prison is so fun, and it's full of gay sex. And just romantic. like in, and, and romance, <laughs> and romantic. <laughs> Guys, wait, we should make a romance. Go to your local. <laughs> <laughs> wait, uh, can we start a Sims game based off two no. two boys, one trench coat? <laughs> yeah. We have to build the world. Disney Channel's not gonna hear this. We gotta put Sims in their face. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And why would they reject anything that's titled Two Boys, One Trench Coat? That is, like, clear and a good idea. It's, like, innocent and quirky. 
Innocence, mm -hmm. quirky, love, friendship, Bella all the things. Bella Thorne, layers, Thorn, layers onions, Shrek, Mar, <laughs> so like, like, <laughs> Love. I can quote that whole scene like from like verbatim. Can you do it? Can't do it. Everybody loves cakes. Cakes have layers. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, why'd you stop? I wanted to hear it. <laughs> because I really do the whole thing. I'm embarrassed. Okay, yeah, do it. Don't be a embarrassed. Okay. Yeah, don't be a pussy. Where am I? Where am I? The words right out of says, my mouth. Everybody loves cakes. Cakes have layers. I don't care what everyone likes. And then Dante says, um, "Plum phase might be the most delicious thing on the whole damn planet." And then that's kind of like, then it like fades into like the next scene <laughs> whenever they go to get the dragon. <laughs> okay. Long story short, my family had this like big ass shitty van with a VCR player in it. And the only thing we had in there was Shrek. So, like, for five years of my life, whenever we would go anywhere, we just watched Shrek in the car. So I know the whole movie, like, word for word. Do the whole movie. Shrek yeah. and Mean Girls. Okay. What the fuck was... Okay. Somebody <laughs> I don't know if I remember this right. Somebody <laughs> Um, can you distort the audio when I say body? So it's like, somebody <laughs> Somebody <laughs> Um, like that, I don't know, I don't have the editing capabilities, but I will look honestly, it up. you can just probably rip it on YouTube. So Some. Ah, thank you. Oh, finish my sentence. <laughs> Wait, that was only like a little, you need the whole movie. Okay. Yeah, give us more First of a scene. taste. Dip, oh, our, dip our toe in the water. Oh, okay, <laughs> after the, after the opening yep. credits, it's, um. Are you hungry? <laughs> you have to actually sing it to remember. Please, I want to get to the part where he mentions a boulder. <laughs> um, I like that boulder. That is a nice boulder. What? <laughs> what? Who lives in a place like that? That would be my home. Oh, well, it's a uh, lovely. And then. <laughs> Donkey enters. <laughs> <laughs> Stage right. Stage right. Interior. Interior. Interior swamp. I can sleep over in uh, swap stores and in the morning. I'm, I'm making waffles. waffles. That's and a classic. Says, uh, outside. And he's like, oh, okay. I guess I, I guess I understand that. I mean, you don't know me and I don't know you. So I guess outside is best. Donkey looks <laughs> so, uh, dejected. Donkey, donkey, donkey. Get rejected. Donkey trots outside of the door, and then it's late at night. Shrek swirling a martini glass with an eyeball in it. Oh. And then the three blind mice come out of nowhere. And he's like, "What?" And then uh, they get the Snow White in the, in the cask, and they push her on the table. And he's like, "What is this?" And then they're like, "Well, what are we supposed to put her? The bed's taken." And all like the the little dwarves come in, and then all the fairy tale creatures come in, surrounding Shrek's humble abode. <laughs> And then they all clap at the end, but I'm trying to remember the speech. He's gonna I'm look. gonna go find out where this Farquaad guy is and get you all out of my swamp and back where you came from. A couple moments of silence. <laughs> and they all start clapping, and then Don's like, oh, road again. Shrek and Don, two best friends of the world win Broad City Adventure. I love it. And then they Broad go City, off. Right? Yeah, and he says something like that. Wait, can we, um, instead of our first like live show being an improv show, can we have it be Lindsay in front of a mic literally reading verbatim like the entire plot to Shrek? I think that'd be a bigger sellout than to us doing improv. Want to see. Yeah, that's what the public uh please uh <laughs> please public vote, retweet, tweet, quote, whatever, live stream, Twitch, YouTube, Facebook. V v that is Vimeo. So cool. Twitches is another great Disney channel. Oh, yeah, Twitches. Oh, yeah. But please send us your thoughts on Lindsay going on stage and just belting the Shrek play. The Muffin Man. The Muffin Man. Remember when Farquaad gets a boner? <laughs> when they're showing him the princesses like they get to Fiona and then you cause he's in bed oh, he looks under the sheet yeah he looks under oh. the sheet but you can see the sheet oh. rises a little bit oh. does he have to check under the blankets like check to see so they come look at me and go ah help run 
a big, stupid, terrifying, ugly ogre. <laughs> they judge me before they even get to know me. <laughs> Man, this is a classic. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, um, I feel like Shrek says a lot of the things that I think about myself. No, <laughs> it's deep from the heart. Do you remember? <laughs> Do you remember in the second movie how um, he, he drinks the potion and he farts? I found yeah. that so funny when I was a kid. When he like drinks the potion, it's just like dramatic, like four minutes of silence, and then he does a big ass fart, and I was like, "Yeah, buddy." Yeah. I think out of all the sequels, like for Shrek, I definitely think the third one was Four the most trippy. No, no, the second one is so good. It is. Second one's debatably better than the first. What was that? Mm. Wait, okay, are you guys actually telling me that the Puss in Boots character? No. He was oh, amazing, he was he was amazing. Was and Tony Banderas was a great actor. <laughs> he had his own movie, and he has his own show on Netflix, and it's atrocious. But Shrek Two was, was fabulous. Oh, I just looked up Lord Farquaad Boner and no, cried as browser. Wait, you didn't look up. <laughs> she's looking up Farquaad <laughs> porn. <laughs> Not in my internet. No, you have to watch the clip. You have okay. to watch the clip. <laughs> Wait, Lord Farquaad gets an erection. <laughs> 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 Where is it? Okay. It's gonna be some weird ass edit. Oh my god. That was it. That was it. 15 dirty Shrek jokes. Shrek, but only when Laura Farquaad is on the screen. Oh, good. We did Shrek in my senior year of high school. It was our final oh. play. <laughs> And the kid who did Farquaad was so good. He just ran on his knees the entire That's time. A, yeah, okay. And what was so funny about it was this kid had knee surgery before, and he was like, ah! <laughs> So I was like, who the fuck subjected this kid to doing a performance solely on his knees? Yeah. Oh, all right, guys. I think that's the end of today's the episode three of the Titcast. Um, you want to give us our parting words, Linz? Give us a nice quote from Shrek. Not the cakes one. You said that already. <laughs> Something new, fresh. She's running through the whole movie. <laughs> It's like, when, it's like when a VCR rewind. Yeah, yeah. No, it's exactly that. Wait, the Shrek VCR was green, and I remember that. Yes. Yeah. Do you guys remember whenever they came out with, like, a bunch of, like, green, like, yeah. ketchup, so like, green ketchup. ketchup? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I remember that. Yeah, I got it. I was like, yeah, I gotta get it. I also, I also had hand soap that was, like, uh, and the soap came out of his ear. He was like this, and it, like, came out of his ear. Yeah, I remember all my friends that came over would be like, yuck, and I was like, it's so funny. I don't want anything that comes on Shrek. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, when you freeze it like that. Well. Oh, oh, can't we just settle this over a pie? <laughs> <laughs> wow. I could barely distinguish what we were doing. What? All right. Lights fade. <laughs> Interior. Interior. <laughs> Exterior. Exterior. Oh. Arena. Lord Farquaad is looking down from his, um, his kingdom. <laughs> Shrek says, well, two, showing some ice. Two, two boys, one trench coat. Great um, pitch. So Lord That's Farquaad is looking down from the balcony. Shrek looks up at Farquaad and he says, Can't we just settle this over a pint? Come on, man. Let's go. And he gets the pint and he smashes the keg full of beer. And then, uh, and then bad uh, reputation by Chen uh, Shrek. Uh, and then that's Shrek great. gets the chair and he hits the guards with it. And, um, yeah, that's the tea. Like, wow, that was such a nice ending capstone <laughs> yeah. to this beautiful I podcast. Mm. I feel fuzzy inside. You are the rights to, like, end up this I could get like a really shitty cover version of it. <laughs> oh yeah, can you can you sing our outro? Yeah. Okay. Come on. Two boys, one coat, one <laughs> hamster, <laughs> one boat, <laughs> one boat. <laughs> Two boys. They're fun. They're for everyone. They're the boys with the trench coat and the hamster. Yeah. <laughs>